representing the United States of America, Guy Cobal, for the South American Back to back American skaters. And this time, last year's American junior champion, Kai Kovac. Dynamic finish for Kai Kovar from America. Kai Kovar, United States of America. And this 16 year old fought really hard on the opening two elements, showcasing how well trained he must be coming into this event. He will be delighted, I am sure. He too, like his compatriot, taught by his parents. The whole family, I'm sure, totally committed to success here on the ISU Junior Grand Prix stage. This, the opening triple axel. Looked off axis in the air, slight inside edge on the landing. We fought well to still get a positive GOE. Grade of execution on that element. This, triple loops, triple toe. Good edge on takeoff. And again, slightly off axis. A little high on the toe pick on the landing. But nevertheless, cleanly done. A lot of preparation for the triple loop. However, it was perfectly timed with the music. And that one of the grade of execution bullet points for the judges too. You can see here, there's the rocker deep edges, changing edge there as he steps through into what was 
really good speed on the combination spin and the camel. Hard to maintain the same level of speed in camel as it is to the sit spin, but did that well throughout this change of edge. And also on the sit forwards feature. I have to acknowledge also the musicality within the step sequence. And there at the end too, punctuating the music with lots of highlights. So we've seen some great skates so far. In the men's short program, lots of clean performances. It'll be interesting to see how the judges ranked Kai Kovar, not only in comparison to his compatriot Maxim Zarkov, who's currently in third, but the leader Nozomu Yoshioka. Kai Kovar has earned in the short program a total of 69.11 points, and he is currently in fourth place. Into fourth for Kai Kovar from America.